Hey guys from the Thoughtful Gardener, are you worried about the emerging cicadias this year? If you're not aware, this is going to be a cicadia apocalypse. No, not really. Uh, the reality is, is there are 15 different broods in the United States that are going to emerge this year. Some have been underground for 13 years. Some have been underground for 17 years. And some of you are going to get both emerging at the same time. And what does that mean for you if you are a gardener? Well, a couple of things. First of all, there's going to be tons of food for our wildlife. So this will be a great year for different birds and mammals that eat insects to have lots and lots of food. And that then means that it's going to be a great year for butterflies because there will be a new food source, less caterpillars are going to be eaten. So it should be a great year for our butterflies in terms of emerging. Keep in mind, caterpillars are nature's hot dogs. They're full of protein, but so are cicadias. And because they're gonna be so numerous, we're gonna have lots more butterflies this year because they will have something that might be more interesting for birds and mammals to eat. I also think that you want to know that because they're creating holes in the ground, this is actually really, really good for allowing air and water down into the ground where they used to be. So it's kind of like if you've ever had your lawn aerated, you're actually aerating underneath these trees for free. Nature's doing that for you. Also too, they'll be pruning your trees. Now I don't know about you, but I've had to have a tree take down recently due to storm damage and it was not cheap, but these will be pruning those branches, which is going to mean that diseased and decaying uh, limbs are going to fall and that's going to help prune the tree naturally. That should mean more flowers and better growth for you in the next year. Now here's where it becomes a little bit heart stopping for the gardeners who have just planted new trees they can absolutely damage or destroy a new sapling. So if you've planted a lot of new trees this year, you might be wanting to invest in some tree cover, uh, creating a, a netting around those trees to protect them from these broods that will be emerging. And because those females have almost a saw-like blade in their bellies that will allow them to cut through those new growth trees, they're gonna lay their eggs there. So that's gonna cause damage and some of your younger trees may not survive that pruning. So knowing that you may want to go ahead and be proactively buying some netting to net the trees as they emerge so that perhaps they will leave them alone. So I hope that you find this video helpful. Leave a comment. Are you excited about the emerging? Are you freaked out by it? I can tell you that it is loud. So that may disturb your slumber. You may need to invest in some noise canceling headphones or earplugs if you're sensitive to it. I actually like the sound of cicadias. It reminds me of my childhood growing up in North Carolina where we used to fall asleep to them on hot summer nights. So enjoy the emergence. It's here, nothing you can do about it. Do know that their dead and decaying bodies are going to be food for your plants which might make up for the fact that their thousands of decaying bodies are going to smell apparently like Limburger cheese. I don't know that you love that. I certainly don't. So that might be one drawback. Maybe it's time to look at the map and figure out where they're not if it bothers you and go to an area to visit maybe some gardens uh, that are not going to be experiencing the emergence. Hope you guys are having a great day. It helps the algorithm if you leave a comment on this video. So I really appreciate you doing that. Also like and subscribe. That way, every time we put up a video, you too can learn about what we're talking about next time on our next episode. Garden thoughtfully and take care.